What's going on with it, YouTube? It's your boy 345 German. In today's video, we're going to be giving y'all the top five cosmetic mods for your Dodge Challenger RT, man. So, if y'all in the market for one of these cars, we're going to be letting y'all know what is the top five cosmetic mods for it. And we're going to get y'all in this video, man. So, make sure y'all. So, you think. I like you. What's going on with the YouTube? It's your boy 345 German. In today's video, we're going to be giving you all the top five cosmetic mods for your Dodge Challenger RT. If this is for the RT, but you can, you know what I'm saying? Do this to any of your other trims if you want to, but we're going to give you all the top five cosmetic mods for your uh, Challenger. So make sure y'all boys like, comment, share, subscribe, and we're going to get you on this vid, man. All right, so cosmetic mod number one, I would say, would be the srt rims y'all so if y'all don't know dodge challengers do not come with these wheels and these ones give it a way better look so these is the hillcap rims so these is the brass monkey srts so i can't see but you can get the five spoke ones as well too but i personally got these ones because these ones is like rare if that makes sense nobody really got these specific terms of them so this will be cosmetic mod number one on the cosmetic mod number two medic mod number two for your dodge challenger would be getting a tent draw so if y'all don't know that should be like one of the first things you should get for your car would be tent as you can see because you want that privacy for your car you know you don't want nobody to just go to your thing and you know what i'm saying just look at you and all that so i would say tent would be the second cosmetic mod that you should get when you first get your car y'all so on to number three cosmetic mod number three would be getting the worker bill slash spoiler y'all so if y'all don't know the stock spoiler is this tall, but as y'all can see, the worker build give it an extra amount of height on it. And it look way more aggressive for the back end. So as y'all can see, y'all see how long it looked compared to the stock one that it came with. This one gave it a way more aggressive look. And I just feel like this should be like one of the things that you should also instantly put on your uh, Challenger. On a number four. Number four, I would say, um, I'm gonna add two of them in this one. So I'm gonna say the tenant tail lights, as y'all can see, tenant tail lights, and then the tenant side markers, y'all. So as y'all can see, all of mine is black, and none of them um orange and yellow no more. I had to do the delete on it because I didn't like that color. So we did an orange and yellow delete on our side markers, and then we also tinted out the tail lights in the back. So you know what I'm saying? That just gave it an extra better look for me because you know my hood on my car is black i meant the roof of my car is black and the hood as well so you know that just gave it a more uh better look to match the black accents if that made sense on the number five the fifth one would be the license plate concealer y'all if y'all can see i do have it so y'all can't see my plate and this just give you um time to take pictures record you can do whatever you want to you know what i'm saying without nobody touching your plates and your sticker and all of that to know who the car registered up under and all that if that makes sense so that just give you a little bit extra privacy and i feel like that's another thing that you should instantly get to if you know what i'm trying to say so that would be number five and we're gonna do one more bonus pretty much just hand a cosmetic mod but this is like a mod that you should do as well off rip dog but his puss ass ran you don't get no respect because your goof ass ran hey my driver swung last cosmetic mod that you should do to your dodge challenger would be adding the z automotive taser y'all so you must must add the z automotive taser in here because we got the taser in here you could do so much to your car like it pretty much jailbreak it if that makes sense so you can have scat pages in here red push button to start um if you didn't have powders you can activate them in here it come with a kill switch um it come with a light show you get srt pages performance pages you get a whole lot i'm about to get inside and i'm about to show y'all real quick through my screen if y'all want to see what i'm talking about so, so as i can see i do got all the pages i got custom i got 
sport mode, track mode. Um, I could change the setup on all of them. And I also got eco mode too, y'all. So say if you wanted to do track mode steering, track mode sport, I meant sport mode traction, but you wanna slap it in custom. I mean, not custom eco, you can still do that. You know what I'm saying? You pretty much can make it like a, a Hellcat scat pack, you know, all of that. And then you also got the performance pages. So I'm about to show y'all what I was talking about with the performance pages. Um, some of them come with it, but some of them don't, but I have the SRT performance pages. If you look at a regular um, trim RC, they don't have that specific one, but um, this is just like something that you also want to add to your car because it's a, it's a must have. And we're gonna catch y'all boys in the next video, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe. And then let me know down in the comment section what cosmetic mod out of the six that I named, what was your favorite that you should do to your Challenger RT, man. And I'm gonna be checking them, man. But we're gonna get up out of here. Peace. Look at my racks solid. I see the grass getting long. Snakes, I'm gonna mow it. I'm gonna blow like brown. Racks on me, I'm sorry. Talk here, top of the morning. I'm in the car, got motion. Bib ain't wrong, can't fall.